What items do I offer in my Patreon store? I'm not a dreamer, and I don't expect any of my subscribers to suddenly be in need of a digital birthday invitation for a three-year-old girl. This product isn't created just so you can buy it to support my channel. This is a commercially licensed item created for you that you can resell on platforms like Etsy, Creative Fabrica, Gumroad, Creative Market, Envato, and others. The license is very simple and so commercial that you can do whatever you want with this product. You can even open a similar store on Patreon, sell it there, or give it away for free. The only restriction is that you can't claim intellectual rights to the item or demand other sellers remove it from the marketplace you want to sell it on, because everyone has the same rights to it. Anyone can buy this product for $20, but if you are my Patreon subscriber, you can download it for free, of course not considering the subscription amount. The subscription cost varies by tier. At the time of recording this video, the founder level is available, which is cheaper than all the other levels, but provides all the options of the most expensive level for now and in the future. I don't want to sacrifice the quality of my videos by creating incomplete versions for YouTube viewers and full versions for Patreon subscribers. Therefore, I offer additional benefits to Patreon supporters, including access to products like these. If there is interest, I will be adding a variety of items to the store, from t-shirt designs to video templates. I have other ideas as well. For different types of products, the package may be different, but I make everything so that you can immediately and without too much hassle start selling it on marketplaces. Let's take a look at what is included in a product using the same digital invite as an example. Included are a link to the Canva template. Listing details such as the title, product description, and keywords. Listing media including images and video. A thank you page which is a product for your buyer. And a guide. In practice, the files you will receive are the PDF guide, the product PDF file, and the listing video. The guide contains brief information about what you have purchased. The product PDF file in this case contains everything except the listing video, which you received as a separate file. The first is the Canva template, which is the main product. Since I'm using a browser with Canva already opened, I see other options being displayed. Let's look at it the way you will see it. Click Use Template for New Design and log in to your Canva account or register if you haven't used Canva yet. It's free and requires no payment information. I don't have Canva on this Google account, so I'm signing up from scratch for a new account. See just three clicks and I have a new Canva account. And there's your product. You can sell this digital invitation in two ways. The first and most popular on Etsy is selling a personalized invitation, meaning the buyer provides data such as name, age, date, address, and so on. And you edit the template and send the buyer the finished item. People like it because they don't have to do anything themselves. They provided the data and got what they want. The second option is to sell a link to the template, and people themselves edit everything to their liking. This option is less popular, but it is also in demand. Here you can edit every detail, remove and add images, change colors, fonts, and of course text. Before selling the product, I recommend making small changes to ensure it is unique and different from the original on the platform. But if you are on the lazy side to change something, no problem. You can sell it as it is. If you have the free version of Canva, Pay attention to watermarks and choose images without a crown. A crown means a premium image, and if you add such an image on a free account, you won't be able to download it to your device.
The next thing is the listing details. It's all done for Etsy, but you can adapt this to any platform. Here's the title, description, and keywords that I picked up using the Everbee software. Next are the images for the listing. You'll probably have to change some of the details you changed in the product. But if you decide to sell everything as is, the only thing you'll need to change is the background image. As it's a premium image and you won't be able to upload it if you're using the free version of Canva. The thank you page is basically a product for your customer and is used when you sell a product as a Canva template. Add links here and remove instructional comments. If you're selling a link to your Canva template, enter your template link here. And here where you ask for feedback, if you're selling on Etsy, you don't have to change anything. If you're selling on another platform, change the link to one that takes to a page where the buyer can leave you feedback. To create a template link for your product, click the Share button, then Template Link. Click the Create Template link, copy the link, and enter it here on the Thank You page. When you're done, download the page as a PDF file and sell it as a digital item on Etsy and other platforms. This is what you can get in my store on Patreon. Thank you so much for your support.